friends, today we're gonna draw a locket necklace. Yeah, it's a really cute necklace, usually shaped in a heart down at the bottom, and you can open it up and put cute little pictures in it of your best friend, or maybe somebody you really like, or yeah, somebody you love in your family. <laughs> we hope you're gonna follow along with us. You need a marker or something to draw with, some paper, and... Something to color with. All right, let's get started. Okay. We're first gonna draw the heart down here at the bottom of our paper. So we're just gonna draw a simple shape like this. We're gonna draw a curve, and then we're gonna come down like this. So it almost looks like we're drawing a question mark. Then we're gonna draw the other side and it's gonna match. So we're gonna curve up like this, around, and then back down. Now it's okay that our two hearts look a little different, right? Yeah. Because the most important thing is... To have fun. Have fun and to... Practice. Practice. All right, let's draw another heart inside of this one. We're gonna start right here, the top, and we're just gonna follow around the outside shape right next to it. All right, and then let's do the same thing on the other side. Just follow it around so we have a smaller heart shape inside of the first one. Okay, Hadley, now let's draw two lines coming out of the top of our heart. Okay, and then let's connect it at the top. Now let's draw the necklace part. We're gonna draw a really fun shape. We'll start down here at the bottom, and we're gonna draw a curve that comes around. And this doesn't have to look exactly the same as mine. And you do a just, different squiggly. Yeah, you can. Just draw a different squiggly line. <laughs> you're gonna have a lot of fun with that shape. <laughs> now we're gonna draw, we're gonna draw two little shapes up here at the top. This is where our necklace connects. Two little circles at the top. Now on the left side, we're gonna follow along on the outside shape, kind of like we did on the heart shape, to give thickness to the chain that goes around our neck. We'll just follow it around and then connect down at the bottom where it goes into the heart. Then we're going to do the same thing on the other side. I'm going to turn my paper upside down to make it a little easier. And I'm going to start at the heart, go all the way around, and then connect to the little circles at the top. You can even turn your paper if you need to. <laughs> and then there we go. We did it. All right, now we could leave it just like this. It looks like the locket part of our necklace is closed. And you could write, I love you on it. But let's draw the locket open. So we're first gonna draw another heart shape right next to it. So we're gonna start here. We're gonna draw that little question mark shape, but we're gonna touch the heart and then come back down. So we're just drawing another heart shape. And we'll do the same thing over here on this side. Draw the outside. Okay, and then let's repeat that same step. Let's go around the inside and draw another heart shape inside of that first one. Okay. Good. Now let's draw the hinge right here that keeps the two hearts connected. We'll draw a little rectangle shape on the left and then also on the right. All right, Hadley, we did it. We finished drawing our locket necklace. It looks really cute, except we still need to do one more thing. What is it? Color it. Yeah, we need to color our necklace. Now, this part we're gonna fast forward, but at the end, you guys can pause it to match the same coloring. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. Hadley, great job on coloring your locket. I love how it turned out. I especially love the two little photos you added. Who's this supposed to be? Me. Yeah, and who's this? You. Oh, you added me and you in the locket. Mm -hmm. I liked it so much I did it to mine also. <laughs> now you guys could draw any photos that you wanted inside of your locket. What else could you draw in there? Your pet, oh. if you have one. Oh yeah, your favorite pet. Maybe you have a pet bird. Or, or your favorite animal. Or Yeah, just your favorite animal. Maybe it's a cheetah. <laughs> or a dog. A dog, like I, yours. I would put a dog in. In yours. Remember also that you don't have to add this extra heart. You could leave that off so that your locket is closed. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing your locket. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun. And we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye. Hey, parents and teachers, join our monthly membership and download our app. You can watch all of our art lessons in a safe, distraction-free environment. In the app, you can also download lessons to watch without any Wi-Fi connection. Just visit artforkidshub.tv to join.